for imported wine. Who can drink rum more than once a month? Dio Dio, it's revolting. Salve. Forgive the lateness of my arrival. I am Ruggerio Ferraro. Aye, Mr. Ferraro. Not a problem. Ladies and gentlemen, a toast to my brief tenure as Governor of the Bahamas. There are under my watch no less than 300 of our pirates took the King's pardon and swore filthy to the crown. And yet, for all my successes, his majesty has Noble and ignorant freaks who rule the world with like me had a firm commitment to seeing justice done. And how is Mrs. Rogers these days? I haven't the faintest idea, and I don't intend to inquire any further. We separated almost five years ago, and both our lives have been the better for it. Forgive my curiosity, Governor. Perhaps I'll be more candid later, when the remainder of my reason has left me. You'll break his neck! Singular. Oh, God. Rogers, any business left unfinished? Yes. And I paid for Nassar's restoration with my own money. Fully three-fourths of the improvements made to that bloody island, I funded by my private fortune. And if that doesn't spell out my commitment, then the king is a fool. 
organization. It is not the will to see a better day. Oh. Are you pickled with drink? He's off, man. My dear fellow, can I... Uh, uh, uh. They torched him, huh? All the same, tis so. Accidents happen, I'll grant. Yet no more favorably than when aided by a dozen men with brands. They <sighs> fear she may not make it. What started out? Thank you for hosting my little send-offs. I haven't been too rambunctious. A little free with your speech today, but nothing to be hanged for. Why then, how's this? Soon, all the monarchies of the world will be obsolete, and when that day comes, men like Torres and myself will reveal ourselves as the architects of their undoing. Oh, Christ, Rogers! You're a bold one. I say, that's a smart-looking outfit. Another but it can't be comfortable in this heat. Attention. Common men of genius and wit so rarely see their efforts rewarded. I hope to change this one day. Give my thanks to the host. This is as fitting a send-off as any man could hope. He was a privateer once. How is it you lack so much respect for sailors only trying to make their way in this world? You couldn't possibly understand my motives, cretin! You have spent a whole lifetime dismantling everything that makes our civilization shine. But I do understand. I've seen the observatory, and I know its power. You'd use that device to spy and blackmail and sabotage. Yes. And yet all for a greater purpose. To ensure justice. To snuff out lies and to seek truth. There's no man on earth who needs that power. Yet you suffer the outlaw Roberts to use it. No. I'm taking it back. And if you tell me where he is, I'll stop the man. <laughs> Here, at the edge of a blade, I find a friend in you at last. Principe, you mad bastard. Our best sources say Principe. What's happened? Is Captain Rogers hurt? Is it a revolt? What's happened? You there! Stay right there! Get down! Stand right there! 